In this video, I want to show you guys the best Android emulator for Windows and Mac. If you're looking for a actual good Android emulator, trust me, you have come to the right place. This is actually a really good Android emulator. In my opinion, there is nothing better than this Android emulator. And this isn't the first time I'm making a video on this Android emulator. I have made a video on this a couple of times before and I have always praised this Android emulator. This is one of my favorite Android emulator. There is a reason why. This is actually a good Android emulator and it performs really well. So just recently I was just playing around with this Android emulator. There was a new update. I updated it and after the update it became even better. So this Android emulator's name is Mumu Player. So this is the official website from here. You can download this and just read this. Run Android games and apps on PC or Mac. This is the most interesting part. No ads. Lightweight, highly stable. The main thing is that it has no ads. I think almost everybody knows about the Bluestacks. It is the most popular Android emulator and also most bloated Android emulator. Compared to that, this one is just way better plus it performs way better than the blue stacks i'm not gonna actually do a comparison here i did a comparison in between this and a blue stacks before you can look up on my channel i'm just gonna talk about this android emulator alone in this video okay so you can download this for mac and windows and it is also coming soon on windows arm devices the copilot plus pcs once you install it it will actually install and create a shortcut for Mumu Player Multi Instance Manager. Here you can create and manage multiple Android instances. And here you can create new instance just with one click. And you can also so do a batch operation like you can run multiple devices at the same time. You know, one of the most important thing after the new update is the new design. It's sleek. It's modern and clean just look at this this thing is beautifully designed okay there are animations uh, everything is just clean okay you can go and select any device and you can go to device settings from here you can change the android emulators settings Vulkan is default. You can select the direct X if you want to. Vulkan will give you the better performance and quality. You can also select the preset high, medium, or custom. Everything is just clean about this Android emulator, including the settings. They are not cluttered, okay? If you go to display here, you can change the display and whatnot. And if you're an app developer, you want to use the ADB, yeah, you can also use the ADB. You can also select the what GPU preset you want to use, like Adreno, 740 the highest gpu on the android or lower one depending on the specs of your pc i think i forgot to mention one thing very important thing here you can force this android emulator to use your pc's gpu so it will use more gpu power and will provide you better performance instead of using a lot of cpu after the new update the main thing that has changed in this android emulator is the design language and improved performance and everything is just clean again it has no ads let's actually launch the android emulator and look at the animation okay it's booting up in multi-instance manager we can see the status and we can run multiple uh, instances if we want to okay and check this out okay have you seen any android emulator this clean it has no ads we have a uh, dock at the bottom just like pc and all the apps that we installed will be displayed on the home screen and if it's full it will create a new page there is no ad and it, this thing looks clean. Now, if I go into settings here, about phone, here we can see this is the Android 12. Anything you launch will feel smooth, okay? It uses tab system, so you can launch multiple apps at the same time, okay? Everything just works so well. Again, this isn't the first time I'm making video on this Android emulator. I've made a couple of videos in this already, maybe three or four, and I've always, to this Android emulator and I have actually used this Android emulator to play games to run apps and this thing just runs so well one of the best thing about this Android emulator is that it utilizes the dedicated GPU more than CPU and it has no ads and now with the new update it actually looks really good the new design 
all the elements, settings, and everything is just clean. Let me show you guys the CPU and GPU usage. The CPU amount it's using is five to six percent. That is actually not that much, okay? Even though I'm running a game, it's a decent game, Clash Royale. You can see the CPU usage is like four to five, six percent, okay? Because it is actually using my dedicated GPU, which is also not that high, only 17, 20 percent. And if you look at my uh, GPU zero, which is integrated GPU, that is being used at like 70 percent because I'm actually using that GPU to record this video using the OBS. And the 20 percent that you see is being used by the uh, Android emulator plus the display monitors. You can see I'm running a game. My resource usage is pretty normal. Uh, again, I'm recording this video, so it's going to use CPU, GPU and everything. So, uh, but we can see here Mumu Player, it's, uh, this is the main one, Mumu VMM Headless Frontend. You can see it is using 5-6% to 6 CPU. This Android emulator is actually a really good Android emulator. It performs really well. Again, there are many Android emulators out there to choose from. And I believe there is nothing better than this Android emulator. Yes, it's the best Android emulator in my opinion. And it gives you the smooth feeling, okay? You have to, I don't know if you can experience it from here, but it runs so well. Again, this isn't the first time I'm making a video on this. And this isn't the first time I'm using this. This has been one of my favorite Android emulator from a very long time now. Yeah, this thing just rocks, okay? Whenever I need to use Android emulator, yeah, this is the one. And now it's even better, okay? Just It's just a wonderful Android emulator. It runs so well, so smooth. I have no words, okay? I haven't seen any Android emulator performing this well. And one more thing, you might think that this video is sponsored, but no, this video isn't sponsored. And one more thing, I actually got a mail from uh, the Momo player team saying that they want to do a uh, sponsor video, but for the Mac Momo player version, not for the Windows. When they newly launched the Mac version of the Momo player, at that time, I mean, still, I don't have the Mac device, so I said that I don't have Mac, so yeah and i actually knew how well this thing is and i'm just giving you guys my genuine opinion on this android emulator this android emulator is actually really really good and again i believe there is nothing better than this android emulator yeah rest you can test by yourself and all that you know i know you guys are smart and everything just feels smooth from emulators settings itself to the emulator itself, the Android system itself. It's just smooth, clean, and this thing can run on almost any PC from low end to high end. Look at the preset here. Low end, one core CPU and one gigabyte of RAM. There is a preset for that. Again, this thing is just so good. Now, the new design, the cleanliness of this thing makes it even better. That's it for this one. Hope you enjoyed it. But if you still have any questions or any suggestions for me, you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.